So that was a thrilling ladies finals and I'm so thrilled that Faye um, Plummer and Thaddea Locke won gold because it's Faye's 40th birthday if you didn't realise um, everyone was singing her happy birthday there. So just getting ready to play uh, their men's final 19 plus 4.0 we have Will and uh, Jamie Basford uh, versus um, Emil Eklund and Mikael Eriksson from Sweden. They've very kindly given us their names on the back of their shirts. <laughs> um, so it uh, looks like Jamie's going to be serving first. And I'm going to enjoy my ice cream while you do the work. Okay. <laughs> zero, zero, two. Side out. And Emil is now serving for Team Sweden. And over to Mikhail, 0 0 2. Side out. Back to Jamie. Zero zero one. Oh, a little bit of an overhit there. We're really thrilled that Team Sweden came along here. I think there's three or four players from Sweden this weekend, and we really appreciate their support. Will serving. Zero zero two. and they've just got their first point. One, zero, two. Side out. Emil serving zero, one, one. That was a good retrieval. And Sweden have now got their first point. One, one, one. The serve was out, so it's now Mikael. One, one, two. Now Team Sweden are stacking. That means that they're keeping the forehand for Mikhail on the right-hand side. One, one, one. Will serving. Oh. <laughs> one, one, two. Now, sitting beside me is um, Seymour Rifkind, and I want to say, say thank you to him for all his help this weekend on the commentating, um, well, just everything, actually. He's, he's been a, a real Trojan, and Riff heads up both the uh, WPF and um, IPTPA organizations, and we're very pleased that he joined us this weekend. Thank you, Riff. Two one one. Two one one. Sorry, two one two. Emil serving. Three one two. Oh. 
Can I put it back to you? I'm not like comfortable doing it. Do you mind? Okay, Riff's back and um, Karen Mitchell, our tournament director, was kind enough to uh, give me two minute break so I could have an ice cream cone. Boy, they have good ice cream here in, in uh, uh, Nottingham. First time having any ice cream in, in uh, the UK. And it was, they said it looked good, but I'll tell you it tasted better. So we're back to the action and uh, we're at 2-3. <clears throat> We got the two young Bathford brothers, Will and uh, Jamie, it, putting in a battle here at 3 3 against the Swedes. Boy, there's some beautiful resets and some nice driving volleys. This is a great point. Good dinks. Very nice point. Swedes come up on top there, but uh, it's 3-3-2. Uh, Young Jamie to serve. He's a lefty, but he's playing on the uh, left side, which means that we've got backhands in the middle. Um, a little surprised at that. I would have thought maybe Jamie would be on the right side so that we'd have two forehands in the middle, but... The brothers know each other's play very well. They play together all the time, so I'm assuming that they uh, have figured it out what's best for them. So it's as, so it's 4-3 on the first server. Mikella to serve. Good hands from Will. Nice reset. Wow, that's a great get. A meal to serve to Will. <laughs> nice. We'll put that ball right at the feet of Mikel and cause the air. So it's uh, side out and it is 3-4, Will serving to Emil. Nice third shot. Uh, Will had his uh, paddle facing the wrong direction and just uh, badly hit that ball out. Nice third shot drop. Good dink. Another good dink. Forehand to forehand. And Will finally gets uh, a, a volley that goes down at the feet for the winner. So it's 4-4. Four, four. Jamie hit a serve to Emil. Third shot drop with a net cord. The, the middle was open, but it looks like Mikel j uh, just punched that ball a little long. So, the Bayfords uh, take the lead at 5-4. Good exchange, side out. Swedes get the best of that one. So it's four serving five. And there's a uh, unforced air with a return in the net. Five, five. Nice deep return from Jamie. Ooh, and the uh, ball hits the net and then pops up into the face of Emil. Will quickly puts his hand up saying sorry, but there's nothing you can do about that. That was just a net cord. And there's just a rushed serve, which goes into the net. So it's 5-5 five, five and a side out. And Will serving to Mikella. Good third shot. Oh! Will slips, takes a dive, but uh, gets the ball over, and Mikel puts the ball away. Good effort on Will's part. 5-5-2. Five, five, It's a side out and the score is still 5-5. Five, five. 
Good deep cross court return for Will. That should be a put away right there, and it is. Will reaches that long reach. The ball popped up a little bit, and uh, Will was able to reach in and put the ball down at the feet. So it's 5-5-2. Five, five, Emil serving to Jamie. Third shot dropped to Will. Will does a nice forehand dink cross court. Another forehand dink cross court. That ball's a little high. Yeah, that's all it took. Will popped that one up a little bit high, and Emil immediately went into on, in the attack mode. Put the ball down at the feet, and it is now 6-5-2. Good return. It's a drive. Somebody's got to go back and get it. Will does and hits a nice third shot. Wow! Great effort by the young Rayford boys. They were both scrambling, hustling to get the ball, and the Swedes just stayed right with it and put the ball away. But that was a great effort on Will and Jamie's part. We're at 7-5, Emil to serve to Jamie. Mikhail does a nice third shot drop, cross court, and Jamie's just hitting the ball a little bit too long on those open shots of his. He's got a slight opening. He's just pushing it a little bit too far. He's got to take a little bit off of it. Score is 8-5, and they're changing sides. So it's uh, the Swedes in the lead right now over Team Engage in the Braffords. <clears throat> Will and Jamie. That stayed in, so I think it's a side out. Let's see if uh, Will and Jamie can get back some of those points they lost. It's 5-8. Good third shot. Nice forehand dink, forehand dink. Look out. Mikkel just got the best of him on that one. It was a nice volley exchange, but Mikkel just got the best of Will on that. So it's 5-8-2, uh, Jamie to serve to Mikhail this time. Nice third shot drop. Look out, it's a little high. And Mikhail just took his eye off that ball and made an unforced error. Easy put away, but uh, took your eye off the ball. So it's 6-8. They need a couple more points to get back in the game. Good third shot drop. Nice dinking, straight on, straight on. Will and Emil dinking back and forth. They're all both staying very patient. Unattackable balls. Finally, that ball comes up a little bit and Emil goes on the attack mode. Goes to the middle and Jamie's unable to get the ball back over the net. So it's 8-6. Good return served by Jamie to Mikel. Third shot drop, and we're right back where we were before. Dinking back and forth, and there's an error by Will. Goes to 9-6. Good defensive lob caused that to just Stay in, and uh, they're rewarded by get winning that point. We'll just hit that ball a little long. So it's 10-6. They got to tighten it up right here. They got to get the serve back. Thinking back and forth. That's a good exchange. Good exchange. By Will and Jamie, they got that point. So it's going to be no, nope, it's not side out. It's second serve. So they got they need one more stop to get the ball back. Good return and a drive into the net from McKellar. So Jamie to serve to Emil, and the score is six ten. Good third shot. Will goes on the offense, and it pays off for him. Kept that ball in play. So 
so we're at 7-10 right now. Ball's a little high. Yeah. 7-10, second serve. Good hands from everybody. That's some good volume. Reset the point, they're back to Dinkin. Cross court dink, cross court dink. Will got the best of that exchange. We're back to 8-10. And the crowd is cheering for the hometown favorites. There's no doubt about that. We got a 16 year old and a 14 year old. You're seeing the future of pickleball right here in England with these two and their brother, 19-year-old Sam Baffert. So, this is quite a family. Nice third shot drop. That's tough. Well, Will's on it, though. It's a great get from Will. Good defensive dink. Boy, he's slipping all over the court, though. It is really slick. He can't get his footing. It's 9-10. They're working their way back into this game. Great play by Will. It's a little high. He drops that one in, though. And it goes long. It's 10-10. They're right back in it. It's timeout, 10-10, they're back in the match. This is one game to 15, win by two. The score is 10-10. The Swedes, Emil and Mikkel, against the Bedford boys, Will and Jamie. Hard fought battle, they were down 10-5. They've just gotten five points in a row to bring it to a tie and the Swedes intelligently call for a timeout to think things over. This whole exchange took place because Will really started to go on the offense and started attacking first on some of those balls. He's got really fast hands and uh, he's uh, stayed within himself and has competed well to bring them back into a tie. So it's 10-10, I believe second server. Uh, and we're ready for action again. Nice third shot. So it's side out 10-10. That was a good timeout because they uh, just won that exchange and got the serve back. But it's a whole new ball game right now, folks. 10-10. Little help from the net cord and that is uh, second server now. Will just got that point by attacking with a nice forehand to Emil's forehand and he just couldn't get uh, get his paddle in position for it. So it's 10-10-2. Uh, Will is winning all these the volley exchanges right now. Don't change anything, keep doing what you're doing. 10-10 on one, Jamie serving. Point. They take the lead for the first time since I've been back from my ice cream cone. It's 11-10. Just missed. Hit the top of the tape. Will's been playing great and so is Jamie. 11-10-2. It's a nice deep return and that one hits the tape as well but stays goes over. That. Well, it's side out and it is 10 11. Nice reset. J Jamie reset that one with a nice block volley. That's going to be over. Will is showing his dominance, but every time that ball comes up just a little bit, he's on the attack, driving that ball down at the Swede's feet. It's second server. 
10-11. Good deep return. They continue to hit the ball each and every time to Will. It's 11-11. Nice third shot drop. That ball sails wide. Will attacked again, went right to the backhand that time of Emil, and uh, he sail had the volley go wide. So it's 11-11. This is a really exciting match here. Good third shot drop. That pays off again. That time, Jamie sped it up, hit the ball right at the body of Emil. Emil was able to get to it, but then Will finished it off. So we're at 12-11. Great shot, great shot. It's 13-11. Two points from the match. Good third shot drop. There's a nice dink. There's the, and another unforced error that time. It's 14-11. This is match point right here for the gold medal. These guys were down 10-5. Will one for the, the winner, which he's been doing the whole day. I don't blame him. He's serving, they're up. They get another shot. Just wide. They call it out. It looks like, well, that's it. Jamie thought it was in. There were some people that were clapping. I don't know if they were clapping because they were Swedes, happy that it was out, or whether they thought the point was, was in. And it's 11-14-2. So they got, need to stop him right here and get the serve back and try to get another shot at, 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 at winning this thing. There's a point for the Swedes. So it tightens up here. It's 12-14. Second serve. That's the first point they've won in a while because it, it is now 12-14, second serve. Emil to serve to Jamie. It's 13-14. The Swedes are going on the attack now first. It appears whoever's going on the attack first with this in this match is the one that's winning the points. There goes Will. Oh no, he was backing up in order to get in position and the ball hit his foot. It's 14-14. This is one game to 15, but you gotta win by two. So it's 14-14. 14 14-14, 14 14, side out, Jamie serves. Unforced air, this is match point right now on Jamie's paddle. It's 15-14-1. Nice third shot drop. There it is. There it is. The young Bayfords come from behind and win this. And there's hugs from all and a big standing ovation for the boys. What a match. What a match. 5-10 down. They come back to win. That's a great match.